When I come home for Thanksgiving, my mom is waiting there for me at the front door. Three glasses of wine into dinner, I start to make political statements that I know she will violently disagree with. Both because I think it's kind of funny to watch her throw handfuls of animal crackers against the wall in anger, but also because I believe them. I tell her, the Islamophobia in this country is like a blaring siren everyone seems to be slumbering through, and this is how shit got started in Nazi Germany. She slams her fist down on the table and asks me, how could you compare this to anti-Semitism? How could you forget the Holocaust? Mom, how could I forget the Holocaust? Where from the time I was small, my veins had been electrified into train tracks. My skin folded into the caution tape surrounding the landmine of guilty survival. Memory is a bear trap, pausing you in midair above a sidewalk that has never stopped moving. Like all things in nature, history is a spiral, a tornado frozen and siphoned into hourglass. Once, I stood in front of the remains of a concentration camp in Poland, saw the apartment buildings not a mile away, and you told me how all of those people just stood there and did nothing as bodies piled to ceilings of gas chambers. Mom, history is a spiral. Years from now, they're going to be asking us, where were you when they spat on that man for praying to Allah? When in a city, a country full of immigrants, a mosque suddenly became the symbol for everything they have deemed un-American. Did you stare like a subway zombie when the teenage boys ripped off her burqa and called her towel head? Did you scrape the dictionary from your tongue when they called her a terrorist? Because our own words have become suicide bombs when we are able to drop them so mindlessly. I am my mother's daughter. Mom, before I even knew how to read, you brought home books about Martin Luther King and read me his speeches. You would cry watching the evening news and dad would say, look how big your mother's heart is. This is where I come from. When I come home, either as a jet-lagged American drunk on the luxury of leaving things behind or a girl walking up the driveway of my mother's house on Thanksgiving, I know I'm an ambassador to those waiting on the other side of the door for me, whether we like it or not. And the cards I hold here, Jew, woman, lesbian, American, crumble under the weight of these simple truths. History is a spiral. I am made of helixes. I am made of spirals. I am wind plugged into a hurricane that hasn't arrived just yet but smells so familiar, Mom. You taught me to be a prism reflecting other people's heartache. So what exactly did you expect me to become? You can't stitch values into me and then complain about how the pattern turned out. <laughs> to my country and my mother, when I come home with this tangle of mirrors underneath my skin that reflects the faces of those you have deemed your enemy, please know I am your daughter. I am all America. I am everything that you have made me to be.